Velázquez, Dali, Picasso, all great Spanish painters, and of course, Francisco Goya. Goya was nothing if not brutally honest in his paintings, using his brush like a cudgel, a blunt instrument exposing the ugliness and barbarism of his time. I'm referring specifically to this work entitled The Third of May, 1808. Based on real events, it depicts the mass execution of Spanish irregulars by a French firing squad. French troops under Napoleon wrangled their way into Spain, ostensibly to help the Spanish conquer Portugal. With 23,000 French soldiers positioned within the country, a coup was a fait accompli. In response, the Spanish people rebelled. This painting illustrates the French quelling of the uprising. In the early hours of May 3, 1808, French troops began executing the rebels. Here Goya makes the visual distinction between the disciplined and regulated soldiers performing their duty with regimental precision, and opposite a citizen army, a ragtag militia being herded to their death, exhibiting a spectrum of emotions, anguish, fear, despair, defiance, and resignation. At the center of this painting, among a pile of dead bodies, a man on his knees illuminated by a single lantern imploring his executioners for mercy. He is representative of all the victims, begging for compassion. It should be noted he's wearing the papal colors of white and yellow, and if you look carefully, you can see the sign of the stigmata on his hand. This wasn't the first time Goya had tackled this subject. Starting in 1810, he began a series of etchings called The Disasters of War, illustrating the atrocities in graphic detail of the conflict between the French and Spanish. Throughout history, there has been a multitude of paintings representing the carnage of war, but none so cruel and merciless as this painting. So potent was its message that it inspired another Spaniard, Pablo Picasso, to paint his masterpiece, Guernica, over a century later. The 3rd of May, 1808, is ensconced in the Museo del Prado in Madrid, Spain, and is available as a handmade oil reproduction from First Art Gallery, the premier supplier of reproductions and portraits. We hope you enjoyed this video. If so, like it, share it, and subscribe to our channel by clicking on the notification bell. To learn more about First Art Gallery, view the video below. To see other 2-Minute Masterpiece videos, go to the playlist above.